Hey friends, welcome to Zero One by Tech News. It's August second, and here are the top tech news updates so far today. First up, Tuckle tickets. We all know the struggle. By the time you log in, the tickets are gone. Now, Indian Railways is testing a system where users who link their Aadhaar card with IRCTC will get priority while booking Tuckle tickets. Why are they doing this? To stop fake accounts and bots from grabbing tickets even before we grab Tuckle tickets. To give A genuine travelers a fair chance to get tickets, but this is also means more of a personal data is linked and stored. Would you link your other if it give you a better chance to ticket booking, or do you feel this is just another push for other everywhere? Drop your thoughts in the comments. Next, that banking app you just downloaded might be fake. Here's a real story. A man in Kerala downloaded what he thought was his bank's app. It looked legit, same logo, same design. He logged in, and within minutes, 1.2 lakh was gone from his account because it wasn't his bank's app. It was a scam designed by hackers. In this scenario, hackers make an app which has a fake splash screen or interference, which users like you or me install from third party or any external like SMS or emails blindly and. we try to input the values like uh, our emails or user id or passwords later those was transferred to them and they try to log in from them and if there is no safety verification or otp stuff to continue further then you might face some issues regarding those accounts so always install apps from official play store or app store if you trying to log in anything from website then make sure you check those domains are legit or safe and check the developer name carefully if you are installed any app not just blindly checking the app logo and avoid installing any app from link shared on whatsapp telegram sms or emails blindly make sure you trust the source where they are getting from next samsung jb park just share something exciting foldable phones aren't just about bigger screens anymore they are packed with ai stuff that makes multitasking smoother camera smarter and even battery usage more efficient imagine your phone automatically arranging apps based on how you use or how you work or editing photos like a pro instantly but here is the real question would you switch to a foldable if it cost the same as normal flagship phone or do you still think they are just fancy toys ai the treats your mind cool or creepy this one sounds like science fiction Scientists have trained AI to read brain activity and recreate what you are seeing or imagining. This could help paralyzed patients communicate or even let artists turn their imaginations into real visuals. But on the flip side, what if tech gets misused? Who controls access to your thoughts? Would you use something like this if it meant faster work or better creativity? Even if privacy work took a hit. and finally a breakthrough for our planet scientists discovered in nano sized metal particles that can break down greenhouse gases like methane and co2 way faster than before if this works on large scale it could seriously cut emissions but implementing this globally means big cost for industries and probably higher prices for us would you support paying a little extra if it meant fighting climate change effectively by using these nano sized metal particles to break down carbon dioxide and methane in future that's all for today please follow 01 byte for daily tech news updates have a great day